Do you remember the last time when we talked about Ant-Man? Well, he is a superhero who can change his size. We've already talked about the smallest tanks on this channel, so now what? Well, now we are going to talk about the largest tanks that have ever been made. Welcome to the Military Future, where we talk a lot about the military. And today we are talking about the largest tanks that were ever made. So without wasting your time, let's get into it. We will start this list with Challenger 2. The Armada tank has been a huge mystery since its debut at a military display in Moscow's Red Circle in 2015. It is a next-generation main battle tank known as the Paper Tiger. However, it has not yet engaged in combat. However, based on what we currently know, the T-14 Armada tank has a lot of benefits if its specifications were as stated. The crew members are housed in a unique multi-layered armor compartment with 360-degree cameras, periscopes, thermal vision, and infrared vision enhancing their ability to operate in nearly any weather condition. The crew relies on an auto-loader because they don't touch the gun physically. A 2882-1 meter, 120 millimeter smoothbore cannon that fires a variety of rounds serves as the primary armament. 10.8 meters long, 3.5 meters wide, and 3.3 meters high make up the tank. Features a combat weight of 48 tons. It has a mantilla masking system and a low-profile design compared to its western rivals. It has a coating that is radar-absorbing. It is a particularly safe vehicle because of how intricate the armor is. The overall protection is up to Stan AG 4569 Level 5. It has explosive reactive armor, a modular armor system, and is comprised of steel composite materials and ceramics. Next, we have Type 10. It is a fourth-generation main battle tank from Japan. It is 3.24 meters broad, 9.49 meters long, and 2.3 meters tall. Three officers, a driver, a commander, and a gunner make up the crew of this completely armored vehicle, which may weigh up to 48 tons. Its 1200 horsepower V8 diesel engine allows it to travel as fast as 70 kilometers per hour. A very good location on the battlefield is made possible by the large variety of armament. It is outfitted with a Browning M2 HB 50 cal machine gun, a Type 74 7.62 machine gun, and a 120 smoothbore cannon. The top secret Japanese command, control, communication, and intelligence system, the C41 system, is a feature of Type 10 and enables a controlling ship to identify an opponent, map out its location, and direct surrounding units to fire at the designated place. Now, this one is older than most of us. Moving on to Char 2C. Even if this tank didn't witness the battlefield's flashes, and nonetheless sends chills down the spine. Don't be deceived by the moniker, which in English translates to mouse. It is a massive tank that was only ever created as a prototype. Sadly, the war ended, and the mass production of this tank was halted before it could do what it was intended to do. Turn the fight to the Nazis' advantage. Few were produced till the end of 1944. The 188 tons it weighs make it the heaviest tank ever constructed. It was intended to be driven by a 44.5 liter, 1000 horsepower, Daimler Benz V12 engine, coupled to an electric generator that supplied power to electrical motors installed on either side of the tank. This power plant made the tank's speed of 20 kilometers per hour possible. Everything about the tank's armor is revealed by its weight. It was the first super heavy tank ever manufactured and the only one that saw combat. It was made of steel plates with varying thicknesses depending on the size. Larger tanks were required in World War I due to the difficult terrain that the smaller tanks couldn't traverse on the battlefields. The FCM Char 2C superseded the FCM F1, which was smaller. Given today's standards, its dimensions are not unexpected. It was the biggest tank at the time, measuring 10.7 meters long, 3 meters wide, and 4.1 meters high. It also weighed 69 tons. A crew of 12 men was needed to run it, each with separate tasks. The tank's drivetrain could only accelerate to 12 kilometers per hour, which was extremely slow and made it an easy target. Next, we have the K2 Black Panther. This $8.5 million tank demonstrates the next generation of tanks. Hyundai Rotom, a subsidiary of the Hyundai Motor Group, precedes this product in South Korea. One of the most sophisticated main combat tanks, far surpassing rivals from China and North Korea. 10.8 meters long, 3.6 meters wide, and 2.4 meters tall are its dimensions. It is incredible to see it float on water, knowing that it weighs 55 tons. The K2 has composite and armor that reacts explosively. Additionally, it contains a mechanism for collective nuclear, biological, and chemical defense. With a blow-off panel, its ammunition shields the crew from harm. Its 120mm gun can fire 10 to 15 rounds per minute and is automatically loaded. Its loading system is comparable to that of the French Leclerc tank. 
As we have mentioned, Leclerc. So let's dive into it. Now we have M1A2 Abrams. The United Arab Emirates Army also used the French-made tank. General Philippe Leclerc, who oversaw the Free French 2nd Armored Division during World War II, is honored by the name. It has a 120mm smoothbore GIA Nexter CN120-26 gun. It has the ability to fire the 1200mm NATO bullets that the German Leopard 2 and the US M1 Abrams uses. It only requires three officers to operate because of the innovative auto-loading technology. It can fire 12 rounds per minute and yet holds 22 ready bullets. The gun can fire a variety of projectiles and missiles, as well as simultaneously have a variety of ammunition. Leclerc can accurately hit its target at a distance of 4,000 meters while moving at 50 kilometers per hour. 9.87 meters long, 6.88 meters without the gun, 3.6 meters broad, and 2.53 meters in height make up its overall measurements. This tank can destroy anything in its path, but those who are subscribed to Military Future will be spared. So what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. Next, we have the Armada. This General Abrams-inspired tank was created by General Dynamics Land Systems and has been used by the US Army since 1990. It is a four-person crew-operated combat vehicle powered by a 1500 horsepower Honeywell AGT 1500 gas turbine engine. With the help of a generator, the turret may continue to function even while the engine is off, saving fuel and reducing the likelihood of being seen or heard. The M1A2 Abrams weighs 62 tons and is 9.7 meters long, 3.7 meters wide, and 2.4 meters high. The majority of the engagements this tank has been in have been victories. It is used by the US Army as well as in Egypt, Australia, Saudi Arabia, Kuwait, and Iraq. It is a 120mm smoothbore main cannon that can fire advanced multipurpose missiles and advanced kinetic energy weapons while in defensive mode to protect people, armored vehicles, and low-flying aircraft. Moving on to Type 99A. The T-10 MBT's class Chinese main battle tank is Type 99A. Provided by Zhang Fang, it was tested for the first time in August 2007 and replaced the Type 99 in service in 2011. The 1500 horsepower 150 HP-2 diesel engine, an upgraded version of the original 1200 horsepower 150 HP model, gives the vehicle agility and acceleration. In order to boost acceleration and top speed, the engine can be put in override mode to produce additional power. Depending on the source, it weighs between 53 and 58 tons and can travel at a top speed of 85 km per hour. It possesses a smoothbore 125mm ZPT-98 I-55 gun that can fire a variety of ammunition and missiles. Anti-tank missiles with tandem charges cannot penetrate Type 99A since it is equipped with explosive reactive armor. It is 10 meters in length with the gun facing forward, 3.7 meters broad with side skirts added, and the top turret is 2.35 meters high. This small giant was the most modern tank currently in use. At last, we have the Panzerkampfwagen 8 Moss. Yes, it's quite a name. The Royal Army of Omen and the British Army have used this bad boy's upgraded main battle tank since 1998 and 2001 respectfully. It has participated in numerous fights in Iraq and was employed in operations in Bosnia and Kosovo. It carries a 120mm rifle tank gun, a BAE Systems Land Systems L30, and later models equipped with the metal L55 smooth barrel cannon, similar to what is mounted on the German Leopard 2A6. The turret can hold up to 50 rounds of different projectiles and missiles, including depleted uranium rounds with a stick charge propellant high explosive smash head, smoke rounds, armor piercing rounds, and fin stabilized discarding sabots. 11.55 meters long, 8.33 meters solely for the hole, 3.52 meters broad, and 2.49 meters in height are its measurements. It has a 1200 horsepower Perkins CV-12 TCA diesel engine and weighs 62.5 tons. It can go 500 kilometers and has a top speed of 56 kilometers per hour. That was all for today. These were some of the largest tanks ever made. If you like this video, then also do check out the video of the smallest tanks that was ever made. Well, see you around.